we're here with Mike. Uh, he stopped by today to uh, have lunch with us, and today's a special day for Mike. It's uh, April the 4th, and my understanding, Mike, is two years ago today is when you came off drugs and alcohol. Is that right? Yes, sir. I, I was drinking and drugging every day, April 4th of 2015. I didn't want to go on. Uh, my roommate called the ambulance. They took me to Park Ridge Hospital. I was in the hospital for two weeks. I prayed to God for help. I was sent from Park Ridge to Valley Hospital. And then on April 17th, I was discharged from Valley. They came straight here to Chattanooga Rescue Mission. Along with their program, prayers, a lot of hard times. I have made it two years today without a drink or a drug. Amen. And this morning, I gave up the cigarettes. Praise the Lord. If he can take the alcohol and drugs from me, he can help me through without the cigarettes. Amen. Um, just, God has really blessed me in these last two years. Mm-hmm. And I have more than I've ever had, which material things don't mean nothing. It's the spiritual part. I feel closer to God than I've ever felt. And it's all thanks to the Chattanooga Rescue Mission. I would pass this place every day and not think nothing about it. I decided I had had enough. Some people at the hospital was talking about sending me to Nashville to a long-term treatment center. And I said, no, I want to go to Chattanooga Rescue Mission. I heard they have a program. And if they will take me, that's where I want to go. But it was God that, you know, brought me here. Like I said, I pass this place every day on the way to get alcohol or drugs. And never thought about, you know, coming in a program or anything until April 4th. And I decided I had enough. I don't know really if it was me that decided it or God. Mm -hmm. But God came into my life. He's still in my life. That's great. And it's, it's just been a wonderful two years. It's been hard times, but there's also been joyful times, happy times. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Mike, for your, your faithfulness to the Lord and for sharing all that he's doing in your life and has done in your life. And uh, God bless you and just continue on and um, we just want to help you any way we can. Thank you. Thank you, Stan.